Look at this, it's super sturdy. I'll also use a brass rod to make the blades even more solid. Hello everyone. Today, I'm going to build a wind turbine that can generate electricity and also indicate wind direction, all for free. Please watch my video to see how it works. And first, let's start by designing a fan blade for this turbine. I'll use cutting paper to make a sample template, and later I'll use a PVC pipe to cut out the actual blades. Okay, so now we have three blades. Make sure to cut them evenly, with the same weight and the same angle of tilt, so that the turbine spins as smoothly as possible. And now I'll move on to making the shaft to hold the three blades in place, making sure it's well balanced. I'll be using 3D printing technology to design and print a shaft that securely holds the three blades and keeps everything nicely balanced. Since I'm currently learning 3D design, I'm using this online 3D design software. It's really quick, simple, and convenient. Now we just need to adjust these cylindrical shapes to make sure they're perfectly balanced, so that when we print it out, the final model will look exactly like this. Next, I'll move on to making the rotating shaft that allows the wind turbine to spin 360 degrees. This way, it can rotate in multiple directions and still generate electricity. Alright, now I'm going to trim this part down a bit so I can install the motor, everyone. Today, I'll be using two 24 volts motors to generate electricity and power some LED lights. Look at this, guys. Just a light spin is enough to make the LED light up. I'll be using two motors like this, connected in parallel, to increase the overall power output. I'm going to drill two holes to secure the motor, everyone. Then I'll go ahead and install one more motor as well. Let's test it out with just one motor first, everyone. Wow, it looks really nice, doesn't it? Absolutely perfect, guys. And next, I'll move on to making the tail part of the wind turbine, everyone. This part helps the turbine align itself with the wind direction. Later on, I'll also run the wiring and add an extra LED at the back to make the turbine look even cooler. There will be four LEDs in the front and one in the back. I'll secure everything firmly with screws, guys. Alright guys, now let's move on to decorating the fan blades. I'm going to use two colors black and white. Once sprayed on, the blades will really stand out and look much better. If you want to see more of my DIY projects, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons and leave a comment to support this video. I'll do my best to make more videos. My YouTube channel is still new, so it hasn't generated any revenue yet. Your likes and comments are a huge motivation that help me create even more awesome videos. Alright guys, back to the main topic next, I'm going to 3D print a tail section to hold the rudder in place. This part helps cut through the wind and adjusts the direction of the blades so they always face the wind. I'll also add a red LED light here, it looks really nice and lights up when the turbine spins. After that, I'll move on to installing the shaft that holds the three blades. Look at this, it's super sturdy. I'll also use a brass rod to make the blades even more solid, and add a gear to increase the speed this helps the motor spin faster and generate more electricity. As you can see, the LED light is flickering a bit because I'm spinning it slowly and haven't added a capacitor yet. If you want the light to shine more steadily, you can add 1 or 2 12 volts capacitors. Next, I'll make a motor protection cover using clear mica. I'll use a high temperature heat gun to soften the mica sheet and shape it into a sturdy and visually appealing motor guard. Alright everyone, that was pretty quick. I've now finished building a three-blade wind turbine that can automatically align with the wind direction. It spins with the wind, guys. Now I'm going to mount it onto the shaft, attach it to this metal pole, and simply place it up high. When the wind blows, it'll start spinning. And whichever direction the wind comes from, it'll turn to face that way, while generating electricity, as you can see in the video. 